Hello and welcome. I'm Scott Dennis. Thanks so much for joining us. Our top story today at noon, one of the biggest methamphetamine busts in Sarasota County history. Just moments ago, Sheriff Tom Knight announcing five arrests and more than eight pounds of meth seized during what's being called Operation Night Train. ABC 7's Jess Dowdrick is live outside of the Sheriff's Office where a press conference just wrapped up. Jess. Scott, this investigation was six months long and detectives seized more than eight pounds of meth, 400 grams of marijuana, a stolen firearm, some prescription pills, and more than $163,000 in drug money. 43-year-old Brian Tharp is the kingpin in this operation and the reason Operation Night Train was launched. Also involved in his drug operation, the Sheriff's Office says 53-year-old Gary McLeod, 26-year-old Dylan Woodward, 45-year-old Kevin Preston, and Tharp's girlfriend, 25-year-old Carly Poeker. This all started back in October of 2017 when Tharp was arrested, charged with distributing large amounts of meth. Between then and now, the four others in his network have been arrested and taken off of Sarasota County streets. Combined, all five of these suspects have 84 prior felony charges and 20 convictions, according to the Sheriff's Office. It's like the ebb and flow of our society. When I started 32 years ago, it was powder cocaine, turned into crack cocaine. Um, then we moved into the pills, and as we read into pain clinics, and we run into the heroin. Fentanyl, as you probably all well know, we never knew about fentanyl until a couple years ago. It popped up on our radar screen. We had some overdoses, and now here we are with the meth. This investigation is still ongoing. More arrests and charges could be coming. Now, Tharp and his girlfriend are still behind bars, according to Sheriff Tom Knight. The other three men have been released on bond. Reporting live in Sarasota, Jess Aldrich, ABC 7, your Suncoast News.